So uh, there's a scenario that is actually uh, very interesting to me because I have a lot of photos and I like to share them on uh, on the web uh, photo album. Uh, but also a lot of photos are actually not stored as files. They are stored in my Outlook PSD file. So let's say this is the PSD file on my computer. And then I have a lot of email messages and many of them have photos because people like to send photos using email. So let's say, hey, wouldn't it be nice if someone actually built a web service? Sorry, a web service. So if someone built a web service, and if I can just submit my PSD file, so that is uh, my PSD file there, and then by using our SDK, the developer can actually just look at the PSD file and extract all the photos from the PSD files. And now what they can do is they can actually use any existing uh, web sharing photo album services and then put my photos into a photo album online that I can share. I can select them, I can select which one I want to share, of course, right? So this is kind of a scenario that is really, really hard to do before. And now, if uh, people have access to the SDK and if they are writing a web service, they can actually just enable the scenario pretty quickly. And then it's also a very uh, nice user experience for the end user because all they need to do is to really just upload their PSD file and then they can start selecting the photos that they want to share. So this is the kind of scenarios that uh, people probably haven't thought about that, but with the tools and the documentation that we are providing, we want to see if people can come up with some new use of, the, of our file format in interesting ways to, to unlock the data. All right, excellent. Any roadmap for the SDK and the, the, the tools? Yes. So currently what we have right now, the SDK is uh, support uh, reading capability, meaning you can read data of the PSD. What we are working on right now is to take it to the next level by also adding writing and creation capability so that you can actually create a new PSD from scratch and modify it. So something else that may enable is that, hey, let's say I have all my email messages on a device or on a web-based email surface. And then if I want to kind of, hey, I'm, uh, I want to take all my email and back, back it up. And if someone have access to the SDK, if they can just write a PSD file based on all the email messages you have on a device or on the surface, then like they can send it back to me and I can just like have a copy for myself. Right? So this is the kind of scenario that um, may, may be enabled by the, uh, the SDK. Okay. Well, thank you very much. You're, you're welcome. Bye. Bye-bye.